Hey, do you know about a balancing robot? Do you want to make your own balancing robot? Then you are in the right place. Here I will show you how to make a self balancing robot easily at your home. So hi guys, welcome to an another video of Tech Studio. For more videos related to technology, please stay connected with us. In this video, I will show you the full process of making a balancing robot including the circuit connection and the Arduino code. So take a quick look to the component and let's see how to make this. First thing is to set up the structure of the balancing robot. Take all the parts including the seats, nut, bolts and L clamps and fix them one by one. Once the structure is ready, you have to make the circuit as per the circuit diagram shown on the screen. Take the motor driver L298N and connect the motor outputs to the DC motors. After connecting the motor in the circuit, take the jumper wire and connect them in the motor driver. Connect the other end of the jumper wire to the digital pins of the Arduino. Connect ENA to D5, IN1 to D6. IN2 to D7, IN3 to D8, IN4 to D9, and ENB to D10. Now take the MPU6050 module and connect the pins of the MPU6050 with the pins of the Arduino.
connect the INT pin of MPU6050 to the D2 pin of Arduino. Connect the SCL and SDA pin to the A5 and A4 pin of Arduino. At last connect the ground to ground pin and VCC to 33 volt pin of Arduino. So we complete the circuit connection. Now place the motor driver Arduino and MPU6050 in the balancing robot. Finally fix the wheels at the motor and give a 12 volt power supply to the robot. Now connect the Arduino with your computer and follow the steps what I do. Go to your Arduino IDE software and open the following code. Here you can see the libraries that are included. Here we define the maximum speed of the motor. And here we define the pins of the motor driver. Here the most important thing is to set up the KP, KD and KI values. First set up the KP, then KD and finally KI. Go to the tools and select the port and Arduino type. And finally upload the code to your Arduino. Now take a look how the balancing robot is working. If it is not stable enough, go to the code once again and set up the KP, KD and KI values. Now you can see the balancing robot is little bit stable. In this way you can also make your own balancing robot.